with Mike Gousseau, infielder for the Milwaukee Brewers. Mike, thanks for the time. Like for I sure. said, uh, I'm focused on the gear, what you wear, why you wear it. And uh, I guess you can start whatever whatever you can reach. Yeah. Show me what you got. Well, we start, we start with the classic Mizuno cleats. I've been with them for a few years now. Um, very, I mean, love the design. It's it's uh, it's treated me well so far. I mean, there's not a lot of guys wearing Mizuno. What do you like about them? Yeah, I'm a really big fan of the leather, honestly. Um, yeah, so, I mean, I, I think they they got the best leather in the game. Um, they uh, they're not shy with uh, you know helping a utility guy out as far as different gloves, different sizes. <clears throat> this one here specifically is kind of my middle infield one, uh, a little bit of second base uh, with the occasional shortstop. So 11 and three quarters, uh, shallow, shallow little glove, uh, shallow pocket. Um, Do you know what the what's what's the say yeah, on the inside? Yeah, uh, GMP uh, 2BK. So the 600 S stands for the shallow pocket. Oh really? Oh, yeah, okay. yeah. So you got that one and that. Same thing with this one. It's kind of the, it's the same model ish. But this is a 12 uh, GMP2. Um, this is a deep pocket though. So this is 12 inch uh, third base glove. Um, you got the little initial breathe. Just a friendly reminder for myself. Uh, anytime uh, you kind of get outside of the game a little bit, uh, just look down on a glove, take a deep breath. It's kind of, it's one of my mental cues that kind of get me back on, on track and a little home base for me. So Yeah, is that is that something that comes into play for you at, at bat as well? I mean Oh for sure. Yeah, yeah. I definitely uh, especially this off season, I uh, really try to like hone in on, on breathing techniques and, and, and patterns and the right time to do it. And then um, I think it, it, it's it's helped me um, so far already uh, a lot and I, I think there's a lot of value to it. So I think we can all kind of benefit from a little bit of breathing. Just a, <laughs> just a deep relaxation breath sometimes, sometimes an athletic breath. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I think it goes a long way. So What's the difference <clears throat> between a uh, relaxation breath and an athletic breath? Uh, I think uh, so my, my relaxation breath is kind of like deep in through the nose and out through the nose. Um, and then my athletic breath is, is kind of deep in, and then I'm trying to push out. So, like, a lot of times with my swing, I try to, I try to sync up you know my my breath with my barrel so as i'm going in and, and loading i'm breathing in and then in, you know when i'm trying to release and, and swing at the ball trying to blow that ball out so so that, i guess that's kind of the difference relaxation going into the box athletic breath while i'm while i'm swinging so that's really cool that's yeah. a really good insight man i, yeah, I appreciate, appreciate that yeah you explaining that what, yeah so no what, what about the bat yeah what are you, oh what yeah are you so we got the bat yeah a little bat weight on there but this is uh, this is my model MB43. Uh, it's very similar to um, kind of like a 143 J143 model, but just a That's different a trout. handle. Yeah, it's exactly right. The trout model, just a different uh, handle. I kind of sometimes I get a little um, like grip uh, callus right there, so more of the tapered handle to kind of not be so drastic. Um, is that the one you were swinging? Uh, it was, yeah. Off, uh, off of, or all this chat. It was, yeah. This is the same one. But no regular lefty. Three, two. Brasso sends one in the left field. Gardner going back, and it is up and gone. Mike Brasso has homered, and the Rays have a two-to-one lead. What a moment for Brasso. Tampa Bay on top on the 10th pitch of the at-bat. Um, the same model, same same weight, about 30, uh, usually go 33 and a half ounces, 31 and a half. I'm sorry, 33 and a half inches, 31 and a half ounces. What did he? Th what did he throw you? What was that? What was the pitch he threw you there? Uh, fastball, low and in. Oh, yeah, you gotta get that thing up sometimes. So uh, left it, left it low, and I was able to kind of, I guess, get the barrel out front, which yeah, is. Yeah, you sure did. Yeah. You sure did. If he doesn't throw it behind your ear, then you get, you at least got a shot. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And this is the same model, uh, just a different axe handle. So. Same model, the the MB forty three X for that one, but only difference is, like I said, sometimes. Oh, the X, yeah. Yeah, sometimes uh, when I'm struggling to kind of like 
get fully extended with it, I'll uh, I'll feel this handle out. Kind of helps with wrist positioning. Yeah, um, Colton so. was calling it his trigger. He was calling the axe his trigger. He was saying like, yeah, it, it also that it helps him kind of realize what his bottom hand's doing. Hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. I think it just um, I think it just it, it keeps the body in check. You know, if you keep doing the same thing over and over again, and uh, you know, not letting your body adjust to other things that the game presents, then you're kind of doing yourself a disservice. So. Um, yeah, so I like to try both out, um, and you know, baseball is always a feel thing. So one week might be feeling the axe handle, the other week yeah, might be feeling regular. Yeah, Franklin BGs, part of the Franklin fam, uh, Navy. Pretty, pretty, pretty simple as far as team colors. Yeah. My favorite snack, ah, oh, Mott's fruit snacks are my is my favorite snack. I take like seven packages out there. I swear, I that was my childhood. So. I promise you, I, there's, when I first walked in the first day and I saw those in our snack tray, I was the happiest man in the world. I was like, this trade could not have gone any better. I put, I put them in my bag. There's probably some in here, honestly. No, I took them all out. I, yeah, I ate them all yesterday. I will bring at least six of those Mott's fruit snacks packages in my baseball bag every time. That's amazing. So, Thanks, Mike. Absolutely. Appreciate it. No worries. No worries.